some recruits when you grow up. Who wants to be a warden? How many people want to be a warden? The Wildlife Warriors Kids Field Lab is the first African conservation area for children. Today we've been learning about rhinos. Very good. Very good. And then two other species were really were rhino. Two species of rhino. So more than got. Kids like Castro can share what they've learned about wildlife here. This is the birds of Kenya, and I know most of them. Today, Castro is going out with a group to find and track animals like birds and rhinos. Along with a guide, everybody headed out into the savanna. Castro has spotted a plant that the black rhino feed on. Meanwhile, the other guide, Tobias, has found a sign that rhinos are in the area. So we said black rhinos are? What do they eat? Grass. Black rhinos. Black rhinos. This dung can help us identify the animal. So what does that tell you? What do they eat? Leaves. They browse on leaves and twigs. Maybe later on we will see a rhino. Back at base camp, everyone was getting ready to see lions. So all of you are going to get one of these devices to wear today. And you're going to pull it on right over your head. And look around, you're going to see lions up close. Does that sound good? Using VR headset to get right up close to wild animals. Wardens were impressed. There was also a journey deep into space with a pop up planetarium. Arrangements had been made to try and find some iconic African animals, like the species that Castro and the guides had previously tracked. Can anyone see clearly the colours? A black rhino. An elephant too. The camp is not just a place to see Africa's best wildlife, but it's a place to learn everything there is to know about them too. And how we can protect these iconic animals.